what I just heard is completely devastating. Mm -hmm. uh, and I wanted to bring you back in to know what you went through and to see this family going through what they're going through with their daughter and your ex-husband. Do you have any advice for the Savage family? I do know that she is loved and she's gonna come out of it because you laid that foundation for her. Keep her prayed <sighs> up. I just want you to know that I'm supported because like you, my family went to the Chicago Sun-Times to Mary Mitchell when they couldn't get in contact with me, my grandfather, my mom, and there was a whole article about it. My order of protection I had against him was in the newspaper. But I just want you to know that I stand in the gap for Joycelyn. And I know that I understand it to a level that no police officer, no counselor, no judge, nobody will understand. And we've done well being checks and they've been unsuccessful. And that's why I'm here because my parents did the same and that's what made them go to the Chicago Sun-Times. And we didn't want to go to the media. We had no choice because they think somebody's over 18, they, you know, they're grown. They're grown. Yes. But we they're know not. our daughter. They're not. We they're know not. she's not saying we, we do get the call, fruit calls we have got, they're like prison calls. Really? Yeah. How do you feel that he's never been prosecuted and now in our society, in a sense, it's, it's constantly repeated itself with him? I think because some, he has enablers. Mm -hmm. You know, just to recently, to my husband and I had the courage to speak out, a lot of these people have now fleed his camp. Mm -hmm. um, they've been enabling him. Mm -hmm. They're enabling him. And they, or either they take small settlements, mm -hmm. a payment, and that's something we refuse to do. Right. Yeah. But like I said, you know, mm -hmm. he doesn't have anybody there to love him enough to mm -hmm. say enough. Drea Kelly loves him enough mm -hmm. to say enough. Mm -hmm. Get help. Mm -hmm. Yes. And that's how, when you know that somebody truly, truly loves you, they're not going to enable you. They're not going to just turn Absolutely. a blind eye mm -hmm. and say it's okay. Somebody that truly loves you, they yank your coattails. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And yes. they tell you. And you know what? If I have to be that person, I get it. And I stand in the gap, and I understand that I'm a vessel. Yeah. I'm so I'm thankful for God's you work. speaking out. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you thank so you. much. We want to thank you all for speaking out as well. We yes. know, well, we don't know how it feels, but you have a safe place here at Sister Circle. Andrea, you know that as well. Yes. And uh, we thank you so much for being with us.